Hello, I'm Dan and this is Solo's Cargo Hold. In this first Sacred Texts video, I'm going to be reviewing the Star Wars Action Figure Price Guide from 2005. I picked up this book in 2005 at the Midnight Madness event for Revenge of the Sith in a Toys R Us store. Uh, a few people have been talking about this book recently, so I thought it'd be a good idea to take a closer look at it. This was made by Fantasia Verlag, who are, or were, a German company. Um, if we just look inside the cover here, um, it's copyright Fantasia Verlag, printed in Germany in 2005. Um, I've been to their website, um, it seems you can only look at the home page, you can't get any further into the site. My assumption is that it's a company that folded some time ago and they seem to have specialised in making um, collector's books like this. Um, I've seen online um, a Playmobil one that they did, uh, also some, some Lego ones I believe. So, um, you know, they were creator of some actually really nice books. Um, I'm not sure whether they had uh, any discussions with Lucasfilm about using the branding or using any of the properties. Um, but but somehow these made it to retail in the UK. So let's get into a little bit of what these books are about. May the force be with you, as always, of course. Um, so we've got like a little introduction there. Um, I won't go. I won't go into the detail of that. Um, we then go into I think some words about uh, variants and, and how to use the book, how the price guide works, um, a bit about fakes and exclusives. Um, I really like this page. Um, it shows all the, the catalogues that came with uh, various boxed vehicles and creatures and play sets. I really like that page. Um, and then uh, the very famous rocket firing Boba Fett and some words about that. Uh, and then we really get into um, the card backs for the vintage figures. And although first it does show the early bird package, uh, the mail away and um, the early bird pack itself. Um, this does have a price guide in it. It says the early bird certificate package is £280 and the early bird set is £420. Now I think that would be a pretty amazing price even when this was released in 2005. So I'm not sure how they generated these prices. Uh, then we're on to um, the figures themselves and all the cards that they came on. And really it's, it's a wonderful library of all the card backs that were available throughout Star Wars, Empire Strikes Back and Return of the Jedi. So I'll flick through there. Goes on to Return of the Jedi, Power of the Force, then we get into some of the vehicles. Um, already some quite high prices against some of these vehicles. And then some prices that maybe, yeah okay, they're more expensive than that now but they're not a million miles away. So it's really interesting to look at how the, how the prices were gauged back in 2005. Yeah, there, for example, Return of the Jedi Snow Speeder for £75. I'd say you could probably get that quite easily now. So yeah, more vehicles, more play sets. Goes on to Ewoks, so the full range of Ewoks there and droids, something that I've not got into collecting Ewoks or droids. I think if I think if there were these kinds of prices today, I might be tempted. Um, sadly, they're a little bit more expensive than that now. Look at this, 28 pounds, 30 pounds. Wow, must have been heaven in 2005. Uh, then we go on to the 90s figures. So Power of the Force, 95 to 2000, again. An amazing library of all the card backs that came out. 
Uh, we've got some mail aways. And then some of the play sets. Um, always found these, these three packs quite interesting. And then here's the one that always intrigued me back when I first bought this book. The Cantina Aliens for £180. I searched high and low for this set back in the day thinking that that was the real price for it. Um, I'm sure it was a printing error, it was supposed to be £18. Um, and to, for the life of me I can't remember whether I actually found it in the end. I know that I did get the Rebel Pilots, uh, I'm not sure if I got that one. But uh, yeah, I can't see it being worth that much even today. On to Power of the Force, vehicles and play sets. Then we get into the Phantom Menace. So all the card backs from the Phantom Menace. Again, really stunning pages, really well laid out. And would have been wonderful as a, a price guide back then. Uh, then on to Power of the Jedi. Then we go on to Star Wars Saga, which were the set of figures that were released at the same time as Episode 2, Attack of the Clones. Um, didn't have the Attack of the Clones branding on there. It's kind of a move that was similar to what happened with The Last Jedi recently, where they didn't include the name of the film on the packaging. Just always tempted by that. Luke Skywalker Bespin, uh, the one where you can pull his hand off and recreate that classic scene with Luke and Vader. Uh, then I'll just carry on flicking through. We get to some Clone Wars. And then uh, it takes quite an interesting direction in that it goes on to discuss 12 inch figures uh, and it actually goes all the way back to 1979 again and then runs the 12 inch figures all the way through to 2005. Again, 12 inch, not something I've got into personally. Uh, it's tagged on some of the die cast right at the end there. Uh, probably would have been better suited to earlier in the book, but better there than not. And then the Epic Force series. And then at the back of the book we have a really nice index so you can find what you're looking for really quickly. A really wonderful book um, and a bit of a steal in my opinion at £9.99. Uh, that's the price I paid for it back in 2005. I've seen people pick this book up recently uh, for less than that, so I think it's a real bargain considering uh, all the information and some of the great images you get in this book. So yeah, hats off to Fantasia Verlag, whoever you are, and thank you very much for creating this book. So thank you very much for viewing, hope you enjoyed this video. Please like and don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you for the next one. Take care and may the force be with you.